Hi guys, welcome back to Chef and Chef It. In our today's episode, we are going to see a classic and basic recipe, brinjal tomato chutney or vardhaninga chutney. This is most commonly seen in Tamil Nadu and it is a perfect combination for dosa, idli, appam and all. And before we moving on to our dish, if you are new to this channel, don't forget to subscribe and tap the bell icon for notification. Please like and share our videos and drop your valuable comments in the comment box. Let's see our ingredients. Two medium sized tomatoes chopped. Five brinjals chopped. And one or one and a half onions, medium sized onions chopped and five dry red chillies, one tablespoon of curry leaves, one tablespoon coriander leaves, one fourth teaspoon turmeric powder, salt, here we have used rock salt, and mustard seeds, then vegetable oil. At first, we need to add all these ingredients in a pressure cooker. First we have added tomatoes and now brinjals. Now onions. In same way we should add all the ingredients one by one. Now dry red chillies and coriander leaves. Then finally turmeric powder. And salt as per our taste. Taste we can add and water as per our need. The ingredients cover our water. See like this. This is an easy to make recipe because we are doing it in a pressure cooker here. So that's it. Close it and cook it for around few minutes, like around two to three whistles. Cook chia. Usually, how we used to cook in pressure cooker in the same way, and it will be done like this. Now we should mash this nicely. Here we have used wooden masher, so it will come like this. With wooden masher, which is done, we will mash it with the. And now for tempering, in a small kadai, we poured oil and added mustard seeds and curry leaves. Like usually, normally we have temper mustard seeds and curry leaves are very And adding it over to our chutney. In our brinjal chutney, we add the tempering and add the mix. That's it. Our superb, easy and classic brinjal chutney is ready. This will be a perfect and superb combination for dosa, idli, appam. I must say this because it is so delicious and so tasty chutney. I hope you all will try this recipe and share your valuable feedback with us. Thank you for those who patiently watch this video fully. And those who are new to this channel, don't forget to subscribe and tap the bell icon. Please like and share our videos. So until next time we come up with another special recipe, we are signing off. Stay safe and healthy. Take care. Bye-bye.